open up Hikaru's chat as usual. Every time uh, you boot up, I get threatened by a few people that they're gonna leave. Oh well, um, I mean that's just a very that's just the nature of um, of streaming. Yeah, I get threatened by everybody. I, I mean, you know, <laughs> Botez goes live. Uh, anybody, anybody. I'm, I'm always they're always threatening me that they're gonna leave. So, but but Levy, I mean, you're the I am. Yeah, but but uh, you know, uh, people ask all the time how I would do against Alexandra, and I mean, I think the truth is that she would adopt me. I'm just too afraid to admit it. So, um, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's uh, it's rough. It's rough, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, I can't compete. What am I supposed to do? You're both way cuter than I am, so it's uh, I'm not too visually appear uh, appearing. That's why I have to wear you know cool hoodies and stuff. So. Levy, I feel okay. like you're the only person who's had someone on stream with you, though, to be fair. To be fair. To be fair. For your birthday, well, you, had, you had a certain someone on your stream. That was, a, that was an interesting experience, I have to say. So, um, first of all, Lucy and I convinced some people that we were cousins. It was really a fun time. Um, yeah, I don't know. Some people, yeah. People thought my mom was Meryl Streep. Oh, so, that's actually a huge compliment. I can see is, that. Yeah. I can see that, yeah. Yeah, my uh, my mom said that a, a, she's even been approached for an autograph in New York and had to tell someone she wasn't Meryl Streep, and they wow. wouldn't believe her. They wouldn't believe her. That yeah. So wow, that's 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 pretty sick, actually. Yeah, my mom <laughs> lives an interesting life. I was like, wow, uh, no one's approached me and been like, you're Daniel Radcliffe. <laughs> that, that hasn't happened yet. Um, so, uh, okay, so we're doing this this classic rock tier list. Um, is it classic rock or is it just rock? Um, well, what is Jimmy? I mean, it, Chuck, I guess Chuck Berry is very classic rock. Um, I think it's just rock though. Some of it's really classic, like Buddy Holly. I mean, that's a little bit insane, but it's, yeah, I think it's like, it's a mix. It's a mix. I don't see, is Grateful Dead on here? No, right? Grateful Dead's not on there. And also like my, I think Rush is not there. See, I've never even heard of Rush. This, you, you might actually know more about music than I do. My, my music my music range is not very good. Like, I know, like, individual songs, but I don't, like, follow groups or, like, their albums at all. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, you guys are going to have fun. I'm really going to sound like a pig on this one because I don't know. Um, rock is something where I know songs, but I don't, like, follow groups or albums. Well, what we can do is we can also use probably Spotify as a resource. I was going to do some research on this. Mm -hmm. Um I, I mean, so we got to figure out what, are, what is our criteria? Is it how many hits they had? Is it uh, how long they were top of the charts? Is it their effect on history? What, mm -hmm. what? I mean, to me, I think it feels like effect on history has to be part of it. Like, I mean, I, I when I see like Elvis, for example, his impact on music, um, not to give away, like a do the spoilers at the start, but I think, I think there are only a handful of people on this list where, who have had like a profound change or impact on, um, on on music and the culture itself so i think those there are quite a few of the not quite a few there are like four or five of those where it's going to be like an ss tier oh wow but this I, one has s and ss okay wow yeah okay hope it's and then there's oh my god this is a harsh tier list and the bottom one is doesn't even deserve to be there okay um well i guess we start with uh with elvis yeah Yes. So, what are your? Uh, we'll just we'll start with you, Love, because you know more than I do on most of this. I think. I well, I I feel like this is kind of a weird start because Elvis absolutely belongs. I feel like in the top five on this list. <laughs> he's, um, he's uh, <laughs> of course he, yeah. I would I I would okay. My first instinct with with Elvis is to mm -hmm. put him into S, and then we just figure it out from there. I think we start. We don't, we don't go well, to the Well, I mean, I guess the yet. question is, are we doing, like, how many SS are we putting? Is it just going to be there's one SS, or can there be two SS, for example? Um, um, how many are on this list? Three, six, nine, 12, 15, 16, 32... Oh my God, it's 47, 49. Yeah, I, th I think they're going to... I think I'm going to put, on my list at least, I'm going to put more than one. Um, so oh, Yeah, of course. So I'm gonna put more than one in SS. So yeah, for me, actually, I'll I'll, I'll talk about Elvis because he's probably it's probably the only entertainer I know a lot about. Um, 
Obviously, it had a profound impact on music, of course, shaking his hips and angering everyone in America um, in the 60s. Uh, lot, basically, I think he was like a combination between like rock and like sort of like, is it like well, like modern kind of hip hop, hip hop in a way. Um, so I think for sure, 50s, 60s, um, I know a lot of Elvis songs, you know, he has, he has many good ones like Jailhouse Rock, um, uh, Return to Center, all sorts of good stuff. Um, I'm going to put Elvis in SS just because of the profound impact he had on culture. I think he's going to go in SS for me. Okay, that's fair. I'll, I'll put him. I'll put him in a. I'll put him in S for now, and we'll figure okay. it out. Okay. There's sure. a there's a few on here that I don't even I don't even know what it says. Well, Can like we... the next one, I can't I can't I actually can't read it right off. That's that's Journey. Oh, that's a J. I don't. Maybe I need glasses. That J looked like an S to me. Okay. Yeah, I'm blind. Now that you say it, I see it, but that J at the start, it looked like an S to me. Journey. Am I blind? Well, I, I don't know. I, I think I just know their, uh, I know their, what's it called? Like their logo. Um, uh, obviously, there's Don't Stop Believing. Um, yeah. There's a few others I know. Is it their, but, um, I mean, is, is, what's the other one? Oh, Any Way You Want It. Yeah. Any way you want it. Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't know much about Journey. I, I mean, I've heard of them. I've heard a few of their songs also. I think to me, they're probably, since I'm not super acquainted with them, I'm going to put them in maybe a D. I okay. just, I, I don't know. I don't think they're just that special. Damn. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out who here. I'm looking further down this list, and I would put a lot of people ahead of Journey. Mm hmm. So I'm inclined to agree. Okay, I'll 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 drop them in in D for now, but they 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 have upward potential because they're like for example this next one Eric Clapton. Mm -hmm. I <laughs> I mean God this list is like so stacked I don't how many how many how many f famous hits did Eric Clapton have? Um, I mean too many to count I think. I mean. I, I think I think Clapton like just just um I think just as a guitarist I mean he he already ranks really high isn't he like one of the top like three guitarists of all time? Okay, that yeah that that I'm I'm not sure of, but obviously I do know. I mean, I um, thought I thought like by most rankings there was uh it's like Clapton and Jimi Hendrix in some order, and then mm -hmm. and then everybody else basically. So I th I think I think I think he's probably S for me. I, I, he hasn't had the same impact the way that, like Elvis has, but he's got to be us for sure, for sure. Okay. Okay. Yeah, he's either S or SS. I would mm -hmm. I would say it's yeah. it, does does he rank above Elvis? Is the question because you put I, Elvis I don't as think SS. So. You don't think so? Not to me, but I mean he's definitely S. He's S or SS for sure. Okay. 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 So yeah. Because up... mm -hmm. no, I was gonna say what what uh. What Elvis did was obviously bigger than what, the Clapton's impact, but yeah, Clapton was incredibly talented. Okay. Well, he is incredibly talented. I, is yeah, he, yeah. Has, has he stopped or I don't know if he stopped, but yeah. Anyway, um, all right. Okay, next up is Sticks. Now that's a group I've heard of. I know very little about Sticks. Um, I I know one of their songs. It's in my playlist. That's it. <laughs> yeah, I don't uh, I don't know much. Let me see. I'll Renegade. I have I have Renegade in my playlist. Oh, Come Sail Away. Oh. Oh, I didn't know that they made Come Sail Away. Huh. Wow. Yeah, I mean, I think they're just a little bit too old. I don't know. Okay, but Journey is better than them. So, I, you know, I then I, I'm going to move Journey up to C oh. and them in D. Like, I mean, come on. It's, you can't, you know. <laughs> like, Journey's got to be, yeah. Uh, I don't know. But I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> Sticks over Journey? Ah, I don't. I don't. I, 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 I think Journey's better. So I'm gonna move Journey to C and Sticks to D. I feel like I can jam. It's actually crazy how many plays Journey songs have on Spotify. Like ten of their songs are over a hundred million. People mm -hmm. love uh, Journey on Spotify. Ooh, Pink Floyd is next. Oh, Pink Floyd. Okay, I'm in. Actually, speaking of which, are the Scorpions on this list? I don't even know who the Scorpions are. But anyway, Pink Floyd, I mean. Huh. 
I think Pink Floyd is S or SS again. I mean, just again. Yeah. This list is pretty hard. Very difficult. I think I'm, I think what I'm going to do is like, there are a couple groups that are going to go in SS just because of the beyond the music, the cultural impact. But um, I think I'm going to put the, I mean, I feel like they are almost SS actually. Now that I look at this, they're, they're, this is such a stacked list that I think they're going to be SS for me. They have to be SS. I, I like Pink Floyd. I don't know their historical impact at all. But I think, like, for me, I like five or six of their songs. Uh, and I'm trying, yeah. Okay, I'll put them in SS for now, and then I'll figure it out later. Okay. Yeah. Pink Floyd is also part of my childhood. My dad listened to a lot of Pink Floyd, so. Nice, very nice, very nice. Um, but, uh, I mean, I don't know. Actually, no, but you know, if I'm going to put Clapton as S, then I, I think I'm going to put Pink Floyd as S too, actually. Okay. Um, then yeah, I just don't know. I, I don't know their historical what is, impact. Oh, next one is Simon and Garfunkel. Um, hmm. Okay, I want to know what you think about this one. Uh, I, I know, I think, two songs that they made. I mean, um, I personally, I personally love Simon and Garfunkel. Um, I've listened to a lot of their songs, you know, like Sound of Silence, uh, Mrs. Robinson. Um, oh, what's, yeah. What's the, yeah. What's, Mrs. There, Robinson and Cecilia. Also. Those are the Oh, Cecilia is another one. Yeah. So I've listened to quite a few of their songs. You know, there's Box or Two, um, Bridge Over Troubled Water. Um, oh, man. On this list, I hate to say this, but I actually, I don't know. I don't, I don't know where they belong. I don't know where they belong. Honestly. A or B. I mean, I'm going to put them in B. You're going to put the, you're going to put them above like Journey and Six, really? Hmm. Oh, that's fair. That's actually yeah. See now, now, now they're moving up. Now they're moving Be, up because like I, 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 don't know because like to me, I really like them, but they're very like very folksy indie. Um, I'm not yeah, sure. Me personally, I don't like I don't like their sound compared to the others. Like that's just mm -hmm. me. Like they're very yeah. I, I, I don't know. Um, I mean, because like if this is classified as rock, as someone in my chat just said, they are not actually. I don't really think of them as being rock. I think of them being more like, you know, like, not, 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 uh, more like indie folksy, like in that era of like Dylan and Joan Baez and, and all those folks. Um, so I don't know. It's like, I'm not sure. I'm actually not sure. Like, like well, to I, me, I, either, either I have to like mix this li list up more or they, they actually go in the bottom category because I'm trying to look here and I don't see anyone else right off. That kind of everyone else that I see here looks like actual rock. They really do, right? Um, mm, is Fleetwood Mac rock? That actually it is, but yeah, you, that's actually more on the edge. So okay, I'll um, I'm gonna just put the I'm just gonna rank them like I normally would. I'll put them as a solid B. I think I'll put them as B. Fleetwood Mac counts as rock. Jesus. Okay. I mean, that's so chill. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll put them as B. I'll put them as B. Okay, uh, uh, Eagles for me is no question. It's SS. <laughs> I'm just putting it up there. I'm, really? What? <laughs> yeah, it's I, for me. It's like easily top three on this list. That's just me. I I, I have too much for it. It's me personally. That's me personally because I also grew up listening to the Eagles. I'm gonna put them in S, maybe, maybe S S, not SS, but they were um. But they were uh, they were a big part of my childhood, so that's just me personally. So. Um, I mean, I think they were good. I um, I mean, <laughs> I, 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 I honestly I think they're overrated. I think they're overrated. I'm gonna be honest. I think they're overrated. I just think they're overrated. I think they're I, like a they're like a B for me. They're overrated. I. Uh... I'm I'm putting them in S and I'm I'm sticking to it. You know, there's okay. this childhood effect. You know, like the Scorpions were not even on this goddamn list, but that's, <laughs> I think they're not anyway. Yeah. Um. All right. So we have T Rex. Wait. What? Hikaru, there's there's also no Guns and Roses by the way on this list. Oh, that's cool. That's true. Yeah. What? Oh my god. Okay. We need Guns and Roses. Wow. Okay. Um okay. okay, so we have T Rex, who I've never even heard of, by the way. I've never heard of T Rex either. Chad, have you heard of T Rex? T Rex. <laughs> not heard of... Okay. <laughs> what is T Rex? I'm looking them up. They're English band formed in 1976. 
Their number one song ever is named Bang a Gong. That sounds like what XQC would yell when he like shoots someone in the face. I've never heard of Bang a Gong. I don't know. They became pioneers of the glam rock movement, so okay. Um I'm putting them in doesn't deserve to be. <laughs> yeah, I am too. I never, yeah, Actually, I'm, I mean, I agree. I agree. The, Hikaru, the next one is also doesn't deserve. I was preparing this. I've never heard of Vanilla Fudge in my life, like ever also. And it turns out that Vanilla Fudge, they have one song and it's a cover of a famous song. That's their most famous song. Okay. Yeah. So they, they I've never even heard of them either. Okay. Okay. So next I, up, we have Talking Heads. Now, this is a group, of course, very famous. Um, what do you think? B or A, probably, I would say. Uh, I, I, Again, the historical impact, I don't know. Uh, they're, they're probably an A. They're I, I an a. Actually, I agree completely. I think they're totally A. They're, at the, they're basically top of A on the borderline of SS. Let me go look at some of their... I also grew up listening to... Like, we had a big playlist, like Talking Heads, Depeche Mode, The Who... Mm -hmm. Psycho Killer, yeah, once in a lifetime burning down the house. Yeah, that's actually Psycho crazy. Psycho Killer, fa, 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 fa. Run, 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 run away. Yeah, okay. let's go. Anyway. Hey, they'll, be the, they'll be the first A tier. They'll be the first. Yeah. Oh, unless you, what did you, where did you put Eagles? I put Eagles in B. I just, I don't, I think they're overrated. <laughs> I just, <laughs> I know that's, you just. No, that, that, that's, that's, that's fine. That's fine. It's, it's, it's also, you know, very close. Uh, Once separated by one. Okay. Okay. Next is the Kinks. Um, okay, I don't. I, 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 I can't I, name a Kinks song off the top of my head, but if I go look, oh, you really got me. Yeah. Lo, yeah. <laughs> Sunny afternoon. Um, I'm not a big fan of this band. I'm sorry. I'm not a. Big I mean, fan I think they're band. fine. I'm not crazy about them. They're also really old. I. I, I mean. Yeah, old is bad. <laughs> I think they're anything a C. old. I, I think they're just C for me. They're just a C, C tier. Nothing special, but they're a C. Okay, I'm gonna put them in C uh, mm -hmm. with Simon and Garfunkel, and Journey has been moved up to B. Really I mean, interesting. Okay. Yeah, okay. Journey. Journey keeps climbing. Black Sabbath. Okay, so this one very iconic. What are your thoughts? Yeah, actually, Iron Man is a song that I I uh, learned to play on the guitar as a kid. It was like I was trying to learn. I didn't learn. I was trying mm -hmm. to learn. Um, I actually, I don't know too much about Black Sabbath. Chad is loving them. I, but I, I think, I think they're, I mean, I think they're, I think they're S. I mean, this, this was of course, Ozzy Osbourne, as everybody knows. Um, I think they're an S tier. And actually, you know, as I'm looking at this, I'm taking Elvis and I'm actually, I, I can't just, I, culturally he had such an impact, but I'm actually revising. I'm going to put him in A, I think. I, I just, I don't know. When I look at the pure music, just as from the pure music standpoint, I don't think Elvis can be an SS because because the pure music itself is not the same. It's just not the same. So I'm actually moving him down to, actually, I'll put him in S maybe. I'll put him in S. But I don't think so. he can be SS because the music itself is good, but the music is not out of this world. It's a combination of all the things c coming together. Okay. I'm trying to figure out where apparently Black Sabbaths are like the godfathers of metal. So mm -hmm. no, Black Sabbath is totally S or SS for sure. So, okay. We have, okay. of course the Beatles. So, you know, I know they've had a lot of great hits levy and they're supposed to be very good. I'm not a big fan personally. So thank you. Oh my God. They're so overrated. Every song sounds the same. The original Black But Sabbath yeah, they're obviously massive historically. Champ. So wait, Levy, are you being serious? Uh, yeah, every song does that does sound the same to me. <laughs> I mean, a lot I was, of people. I was, I was trolling. I was totally trolling. Oh my god, I was totally trolling, and then you went along with my troll, and you. <laughs> no, I, 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 I actually, I'm not like I get it, and everybody loves them. I'm like okay, I'm okay with the Beatles. Like I'm fine. Well, whatever you want to do with with the tier, I'll put it up. I mean, the Beatles are, I mean, probably the great. I mean, they're SS without a doubt. I mean, they. I mean, so many good albums. Um, you know, there's like Sgt. Pepper. There's Abbey Road. Um, a lot of the early stuff was good too. I know. Um, I know. I know. That's what I'm saying. Like, I know. I just, I don't have them in my playlist. I just, I, you know, 
Yeah, I mean they're like, they're they're SS. Someone in sh- what's your favorite Beatles song, Levy? <laughs> uh, oh god. Uh Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. It's okay. named after my okay. girl. I mean, how can you so. not be a fan of the Beatles, Levy? How can you not be a fan? I like you just gotta you know, love them. I could, you know, I like I said, it's it's probably the only band on this list. If we if we go down uh like every song, I can probably like name 10 or 15 because of how much I've listened to. It might just be I'm jaded, you know. I've listened oh, no, to them fine. since I was a kid. You know, when I asked you that question, I was actually trying to uh, do a takeoff. Have you seen Office Space, the movie? No, weren't you talking about it recently? Yeah, scene? anyway, there's a scene where there's a guy who has the same name. That he goes in for a job interview, and he has the same name. He has, his name is Michael Bolton, and there's a singer, Michael Bolton. And basically, oh. they, basically they're asking, like, how, how are you, like, you know, how, he must love his music and all this stuff. So I'm like, I'm trying to bait you in the same way to get you um, to have to answer the question about No, the I'm very happy to share my take. <laughs> I, I just, like, I wouldn't listen... You know, I, I just, I don't know. I wouldn't, not, yeah. not, not the biggest fan. <laughs> like, I get it. Like, I wouldn't, you know, I'm, like, they're up there. I just. Yeah, I mean, they're SS. I mean, if even beyond as a group, the the, the pure fact that as, as, um, as individual artists, they were so, um, they were, they were so successful. I mean, you look at Paul McCartney on his own, very successful. Um, you look at John Lennon, also very successful. I mean, Beatles have to be SS. I don't think there's anyone. There's any group that had the same kind of influence that they did. So awesome. thank you, by the way, to Black, Black Pepper as well for the 5,000 bits. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Um, so they're SS, 100%. Okay, next up we have Janis Joplin. Wow, this is so old school. Um, what do you, I, I mean, do you, have you listened to her or not? I have, but I, I probably can't speak to like the 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 effect on anything really <laughs> like i'm deferring to you man you're 33 <laughs> i don't i mean <laughs> i mean we, we got everything from c to ss in the chat so I, I i really i don't know i mean i don't know much about her music i've listened a little bit um i don't know i really don't know where are you putting her uh, wherever I get convinced to to, to put uh, at, at mo- chat seems to be maybe chat decides this one. Yeah, I'll let chat decide then. I B or C. Yeah, it looks like B or C pretty much. Yeah. Also, no ACDC. Yeah, there's and some no- groups that are missing on this for sure. Yeah, it looks like B or C. I'm gonna go with I'll go with B. I'll go with. But I mean, I can't put her in the same tier as the Eagles. Like I that's. No, I'm going with C. I'm going with C. Well, you can, you know. No, I mean, I, as much as I think the Eagles are overrated, I cannot put her in the same group as, as the Eagles. That's just insane. Um, okay. All right, next, of course, we have Van Halen. Yes. Didn't he, didn't he, um. A. Didn't he die this year or am I crazy? Yes. I think he died, he died yeah. a couple yeah. months ago, yeah. right? So, so rip, yeah. Um, what do you think? I think, I think A. I think Van Halen is a is a solid A. Yeah, I, I agree. I, I think that's pretty fair, yeah. Although Family Guy literally just did an entire episode about Van Halen. So <laughs> maybe maybe he deserves to be higher. Um no, I I, I know lot 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 of good. I I don't know. Like I said, I I think he's I think I think it was fantastic. So mm-hmm. okay. Next up we have Chuck Berry. Okay, now this is like I'm, I mean, I know who Chuck Berry is, but I'm actually not sure what his hits were exactly. So, I mean, I've, I've heard of him, but... Johnny Be Good? He, isn't he like a predecessor to um, predecessor to, uh, to Elvis, kind of, or am I wrong? Oh, I thought I, he was kind he, of the predecessor to Elvis for like, for like the showmanship and stuff. But maybe I'm wrong. He's, pro- he's probably S tier, because I, because I think Jimi Hendrix is SS tier. And I, mm-hmm. I feel like we can't have back-to-back SS, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe he's SS. I don't know. Yeah, because I thought he was like he was the predecessor to uh, to Elvis. So um, I think, yeah, I think he's going to – I think he goes SS. I think it's got to be SS. Okay, but then Jimi Hendrix is also unquestionably SS, right? So – Yeah, I mean, without a doubt. I mean, Jimi Hendrix is, uh, of course, the uh, – I mean, I mean, he's the greatest guitarist of all time. So, yeah, 100% SS. So okay, um, Hikaru, what's this next one? This this black circle with a thing. What is that? I can't tell. 
I also can't tell chat. What what is this? I I still can't tell. Like when we when I got this list, I couldn't tell. I still don't know. What is it? What is this chat? What is this this black one? I I can't tell. Is, is this Bob Dylan? Oh, okay. So this is Bob Dylan, Levy. Um, what are your thoughts? Wait, what? This thing's Bob Dylan. Oh, yeah, it says Bob Dylan. Oh. Yeah. Okay. What are your thoughts, Levy? Wasn't it wasn't Bob Dylan like huge? Um, all right. So, yes, in terms of Bob Dylan, here's what I'm going to say. Bob Dylan, I think, is probably the, uh, he's probably the, gr I mean, he's one of the greatest, if not the greatest, I think, um, so songwriter for sure. Um, but as a musician, I have never heard someone who has a worse voice and uh, can sing as badly as I do. So um, as a songwriter, I think he's amazing. But Bob Dylan, as a, as a, as a singer, um, I mean, I'm sorry, he's just. I, I mean, I, I feel like he's as bad of a singer as I am, if I'm being honest. Wow. But you're a pretty good singer. <laughs> you got to give yourself some credit. A good one, Levy. Um, yeah, I know. I remember, like, actually, I'll, I'll, I don't remember which Grammys this was. There were some Grammys when I was really young, and I was watching um, I was watching it. And I think he was performing. I'm like, this dude is so bad. And then I remember even when he was performing, some kid or somebody ran up on stage and had, like, they had, like, soy bomb or something, like, written on their chest i think it was like or on their shirt and um and, uh, it was really really funny <laughs> but um but yeah um anyway i mean his his uh his 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 songwriting i think is unparalleled but the reason i'm gonna put him as doesn't deserve to be on this list because when i look at the, everybody else on the list like their performance as musicians was out of this world and his songwriting was out of this world but his actual singing i think is pretty terrible if i'm being honest um so where does he go i'm putting him as doesn't deserve to be on this list because i just i mean i just i mean as a songwriter he's amazing but as as an actual like singer you know i just don't think he belongs on the list huh i'm conflicted chad is mad at me that's okay people people were upset about my eagles placement <laughs> that, people are people are gonna get upset as we go down this list yeah no, I mean, I think as a songwriter, it's it, there's. I mean, he's probably one of the best, if not the best. But I just think as a singer, I mean, he doesn't have the whole package. That so to me, that's kind of the reason. Thinking, it's a bad take. Yeah, it's a bad take. Okay. I, the, the songs are great, by the way. The songs are great. I just think his voice. I cannot listen to his voice. I can't listen to any of his music. If you take his songs and you give them to someone else who sings it, I think they're 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 just they're just awesome. But as as a singer, I just I can't deal with it. Okay. That's... Now see, like if this was like sep if this, if this was a different sort of tier list, I could I would easily put him in like an know, S tier. I just but I just I, I feel like I mean when I look at like these people like Chuck Berry, Jimi Hendrix, the Beatles, I mean the like look at the Beatles for example, they were phenomenal songwriters too. You look at Paul McCartney and John Lennon, I mean amazing songwriters, but they could also sing really well. Like so that that's why I just I don't know. To me, I mean I I I just look at it that way. And you don't have to agree, but. Yeah, I I don't know. I'm not educated enough on the subject. I just know that like I mm -hmm. I liked a few Bob Dylan songs, and I know him better than some other people. So, mm -hmm. um, why don't we just go to the next one? The next one's a pretty easy one. Uh, yeah, of course. So where do they belong? Well, my first instinct with the Rolling Stones is SS, and it's not even a question. Um, <sighs> I mean, then I then I start looking around. I mean, to me, Rolling Stones, they're, they're, they're iconic. Um, they're, I, I think they're probably S, but I, I don't know. I would say bottom, um, bottom, bottom part. Uh, by the way, someone in chat wrote something really funny. They said, putting Bob Dylan there is like saying Hikaru is not on the list because he only wears hoodies. <laughs> That's a good comment. <laughs> Yeah, for, it's it's probably it's probably bottom tier SS. I'll put I'll put Rolling Stones. I don't know. Yeah, I, I think bottom tier S. I, I mean, I think they're above A, but the, I 
can't put them at the top of us. By the way, though, speaking of Rolling Stones, it's funny because we were just talking about Bob Dylan. And um, so my mom, for example, who, who's a musician, classically trained violinist, um, she hates the Rolling Stones. Like, she cannot stand Mick Jagger's voice. So it's pretty funny um, now, now that we're putting this so high because I guess everyone has their own, own take on them, uh, well, yeah. on singers. So yeah, <laughs> we're just the we're just the guys on camera who have to talk about it. But yeah, I can't stand them too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, we're we gonna have... get a, we're gonna get a string of garbage ones here. Well, I not mean, Fleetwood Mac. Fleetwood Mac's really good. Yeah, I mean Fleetwood Mac. Like, I guess what I would say is when I was young, some of these groups, it's very hit or miss. But some of them, I just bought like a CD, and so like with the Beatles or the Eagles. Um, or um or Elvis and like Fleetwood Mac. I just had an entire album that I would just listen to um in the C D player. So actually that makes me sound really old. Um anyway. No, it doesn't. I ha- I use the C D I use the Walkman. Oh, okay, okay, cool, cool. Good stuff. I used to walk around with my, with my um, Walkman. Um So Fleetwood Mac, where I th- I think they're A. I think they're for me I have Talking Heads and Van Halen. I think mm-hmm. for me personally they're a... Uh, they're in the A. I don't. I don't know how to sort these, but they're they're in A tier. I think. I mean, I think Fleetwood for me, they're at the top of B tier. I, I mean, I think they're very good. Um, I mean, they have so many so many hits. Um, but I think they're top of B. They're top of B or bottom of A. I'm gonna put them top of B for now. I might change them to bottom of A, but I'm not sure. So okay, next up we have Neil Young. <laughs> okay, let me you take it away. You you. Wh- why are you laughing? Is there, is there, did Neil Young, like, I don't know a single song that Neil Young ever made. I don't know who he is, and I don't know any of his music. Isn't, didn't he do Sweet Caroline, or am I wrong? Am I wrong? Let me just, I'll just go Google. Uh, that was Neil Diamond. Oh, sorry. Oh, um, wait, I've got the wrong song. What, what was the song he did? I think that, exactly. Squidward I don't know. Subscribed. I... Good luck in the finals, you stud Kyle is love. Yeah, I'm. I've heard of him, but what is his big song? Cause I've, I've heard of him, but I, I I'm not pulling this song right now. Um. Oh, he's from Crosby, Stills, Nash and Young. Okay. Um. Oh, he did "Rockin' in the Free World." Oh. Uh well, yeah, yeah. I... Actually, yes. Right, 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 right. Mm-hmm. I mean, I don't know. I, do you, do you really want to know my honest opinion? I think he's good, but I there's nothing there's nothing special about him. So I'm gonna put he, that he doesn't deserve to be on the list. Wow. <laughs> he's, I, 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 mean, I, feel, I, I I can't do that to him because there's vanilla fudge. Like first okay. of all, what, is, <laughs> okay, what even okay. is vanilla fudge? First yeah. Okay. Of all, actually, right? you know, I'm gonna revise it now. Now that you put it like that, actually, I can't. I actually now that you put it like that, when I look at vanilla fudge and T Rex, I can't put Bob Dylan down there. That's just not appropriate. Yeah. Like um, it's like the floor is lava. Like what? <laughs> yeah. 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 No. Actually, that that's true. Um. So, yeah, I'm going to put Bob Dylan up in C. I'll just put him in the middle of C, actually. I, I um, put Neil Young low, low B, low B. Low I mean, B? He, I'm going to put I'm him getting, in, I'm going to leave him in D. I'm getting yelled at. Apparently, I'm taking a big L on this one. Where is Led Zeppelin? Uh, the second to last one. Stop yelling at me, dude. Mm-hmm. Okay, so next is The Animals. What was their hit? Uh, House of Rising Sun. Oh, right, right, Um. Are the animals considered a, a one-hit wonder, or do they have like long-term good music? I think that aren't they a one-hit wonder? Am I wrong? I think they are a one-hit wonder. I mean, it's a very good song, but we got to get out. They this. are okay, not. So someone says they two, are not. Okay, two-hit wonder. Okay, someone's saying one-hit wonder for we sure. Yeah, get I, I don't know. Place. It's my life inside. Looking out, I'm crying. Actually, I've never heard of any of these songs. Got to get out of this place. It's my life inside. Looking, I'm crying. Don't let me be misunderstood. Don't let me be misunderstood. I don't. I'm, I'm not. I don't think I've heard those songs. Not sure. Yeah, I'm not very opinionated on. Um, I'm gonna put them in D just for now. I don't know. Okay, placeholder. Yeah, and then next up we have Toto. Um, Did Toto make any it, other songs besides Africa? Isn't Toto a one-hit wonder? Oh, hold the line and Rosanna. What? Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm. Wait, Ros- but Rosanna. Okay. I mean, 
I, I mean, Africa's a great song, but I mean, that's one song. They're SS only for Africa, guys. That's why. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I mean, I, I really don't know. Yeah, I also. I'll just put them in C, I guess. Actually, you know what's funny? It's very weird, but as this list keeps going on, I actually keep. I'm feeling it's urged as I look at these lists. Um, to move Bob Dylan up further, so I think I'm gonna actually move him to B now. <laughs> just, That's where I have him. Yeah. Yeah. I just I feel like somehow as I keep looking at this list, he keeps improving. I'm not really sure why, but anyway. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. So next up we have the Beach Boys. Okay. Um, yeah, people love the Beach Boys, but I mean they're pretty solid classic rock. Um, <laughs> As more garbage he's pouring and Dylan is ascending. Yeah. Um, good one. Um, I mean, they're pretty good. Brian Wilson, of course, was 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 a great singer. Um, I mean, I think they're just classic. I'm going to say they're just probably classic. I don't I feel like they're probably C. I would say they're upper upper end of C, probably. So I think I think they're a C. Yeah, that that seems kind of fair. So next up, we have Steppenwolf. I feel like the Beach Boys have like Hollister strip mall music. <laughs> Very like serving you as like like I don't know. I I, I mm-hmm. just I just I don't know. I agree. I agree with that. Yeah. No, that's true. That's true. Um, what is Steppenwolf? I've never even heard of them. Steppenwolf. Uh... Well, okay, it sounds German. Oh, Born to be Wild. Yeah. Yeah. But that's one hit wonder again, right? Or I Magic know. Carpet, right? Okay. They have a song called Hoochie Coochie, man. Um, that's quite a. <laughs> Zero memes just reset. Um, three months. Yo. I just don't know much. I'm going to put them in C, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, I can talk a lot more about the Ramones than I can about Steppenwolf, unfortunately. Same, same, yeah. So, what what do you want to say about uh, Ramones? Uh, they had... Well, actually, I, I mean, maybe it's just me. I had a lot more uh, exposure to them because mm-hmm. growing up, uh, my my stepsister listened to a lot of Ramones and so I listened to a lot of Ramones by virtue of listening to a lot of Ramones very loudly in the house that's my story mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. I like them I like them a lot I have like kind of like the Eagles but I'm I'm being told wow Hikaru this band is causing like intense debate so I mean from- I, they're amazing for me they're amazing like it's everything from S to D um yeah, I'd pr- probably put them at the top of B for me. Yeah, I mean, they, they, I, I think for me, I mean, they, they are kind of, I feel like if you're on if you're on the East Coast or you're, like, new, from New York, you definitely know who they are. Um, like, you, they, they have more of, like, that feel. I think I, I'm going to put them, I think they're, are they top of B or? Uh, this keeps getting worse, by the way. This this is literally, this gets worse. So I want to put them top of B. But the problem is if I put them top of B, someone else is going to go up to A then. That's the problem. Like, this is ridiculous. I'm just going to, I'm going to quickly go to the bathroom. Sure, um, no problem. Be, before yeah. this next one, before this next one is terrible. Okay, okay, sure. No, the problem is, you guys, if, if I put them in B... I mean, I think Bob Dylan is better. I mean, I think Bob Dylan is better. That's the problem. Like, I mean, can I really say that that the Ramones are better than Bob Dylan? Like, I mean, I don't know. Like, I don't know. (laughs) Bob Dylan stalks the moon. Just shoot Dylan up to S and be done with it. Yeah. Um... I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> no, but, but but you guys, the problem is that when I look at this, his actual impact is great. Even if I think the guy couldn't sing to save his life, um, his uh, 
even if I think I think he couldn't sing to save save his life, like he did have a major impact, and a lot of the covers of his songs have been been amazing. So that that's the thing. And yeah, I don't know why. I, I mean, this isn't our list, you guys. So there are groups that are missing, just to be clear. Um, but yeah, I think hold your ground and keep him in B. <laughs> um, yeah. I, th I think I'm going to put, I'll, I'll, I'll wait for Levy to get back, but I think I'm going to put Ramones probably in B as my guess. Probably in B. Probably in B. But I'll, I'll move Dylan to the very top of B and I'll put, I'll put the Ramones at the bottom of B. That's what I'll do. Why isn't Elton John on this? Actually, that's a good question. I don't know. Um, that, that's a very good question. He should also be on this list because when I see the, all these British bands, like you see like, um, you see Queen, you see the Beatles. Hey, how's it going, Levy? So I put Ramones at the bottom of B. Okay. Um, okay, next up, by the way, chat, if you guys don't like this, I think there are probably are ways you can create your own list. Um, or maybe if they could somebody... also just do this one, they could like, I mean, yeah. Next up we have who is that Bob Saget? No, who's that? Bob? Yeah. Sager, oh, Bob. Se yeah. Bo oh, Bob. Se Seeger? Yeah. Seeger, Seeger. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, sorry. Doesn't deserve to be on the list. I, yeah. Uh, Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, um, yeah yeah i agree okay um all right okay um next up is is santana a top uh, guitarist of all time i think he's probably top five i mean i don't think he's comparable with clapton and um and uh, Jimi hendrix but i think after those two he's in that group it's like it would be like, I don't know, it would be like in chess, what is it? It's like, you know, there was Kasparov and Karpov, right? And then it would be like, who was like third best when they were the top two? That's what it would be like. Wasn't it Yusupov once? Maybe, so that's what I'm saying. But like, you would never put that name in that category with Kasparov and Karpov. Mm. So I feel like that's what it is. You have like Jimi Hendrix and you have Eric Clapton. And then you have people who are incredible, but they're just not at that level. I mean, I think, I mean, he's done a lot of good stuff. So I think Carla should be B probably, I think. I think B middle B oh, maybe I did not, A. I did not expect that. I oh. I would have put him in A or S. Oh, okay. Okay. I mean, I guess I can put him in bottom A then. Cuz I was thinking already top top of top of a uh, top of B. Hmm. I'll put him in A. I'll put him in A. I like I like a lot of his music. For me, he's 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 around. Yeah, I have 4 in A, so it's probably second. Hmm. Although he's either that or bottom S. Well, I think you, I'll put you, him you bottom have your own S. Tier, so yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna put him bottom S and I have to shuffle a few around. Yeah. I don't know. Santana is like Ivanchuk. Is what uh Oh really? Hmm. Fair enough. Um apparently. Um Pink Floyd, you guys, is already in the S tier. We already we already did uh did them. I don't know why everyone's so triggered by my Toto listing. I don't think Toto's good. Like, I mean, they're fine, but they they don't have that many hits. Like, uh, they just don't. <laughs> okay, so so next up is who? Wh who's yeah, next? That, yeah. What is this? Yeah. Elo? What's it? Uh, Electric Light Orchestra. Apparently, they made a song called "Mr. Blue Sky" and "Don't Bring Me Down." Don't bring me down. I know, but it's. I've never heard of them, so it's not. I've never even heard of them, so yeah. I'm... What is Mister Blue Sky? I gotta listen to. I've never even heard of them. Like, I, I, I yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I, I mean, I know this these songs now that I'm looking at them, but Ticket to the Moon is incredible. What even is that? What is Ticket to the Moon? Like I said, I, I mean, I haven't, I haven't heard a lot. Okay, maybe, maybe they, maybe they do have some hits. I don't know. They were late '70s, similar to Boston. How do you guys know all these songs? I mean, people do spend time on music. I just, I, somehow, it's one of those things that I never like. I just listen to songs. I, I mean, I think it's probably a generation thing too. Like, because if you think about it, 
like if, if, when I was young, like when I was really young, let's just say you were like 20 years, 20 years old. And I was like, you know, five year, five or six or something. Mm -hmm. You had to buy the whole CD, right? I think we just spent too much time on the internet chess club. No, no, but no, but I mean, seriously, Lovey, if you think about it, you had to buy the whole CD, didn't you? Or like the, the record you had to buy the whole thing. You had to buy the whole album. So you would listen to like the whole, all the songs mm -hmm. or the tape or whatever, but you'd listen to all the songs. Whereas like, as we're growing up, you make these playlists and it's just one song here, one song there. So you don't really get the, uh, you don't get that same sense going on because you don't really, you're not forced to listen to all the songs. Yeah. The same way, I think. So, but okay, also, I'm, I'm going to move them because people are saying they shouldn't be in D. So I'll just put them in B for now. I mean, it's also like how you were introduced to stuff. I mean, mm -hmm. I, like there's literally some of these, some of these people I've just straight up never heard of. Um, yeah. Okay. Right. I don't know, guys. I, I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong, but I actually I think that's probably part of the reason because, like, I mean, for example, if my if my stepdad bought like bought like the you know the um the the uh the Beatles like it was the two it was the full uh the the anthology which was two CDs of their greatest hits so like I had to listen to all the songs which is why I'm familiar with them same as like Fleetwood Mac or anything else um but like a lot of these groups if I if I didn't listen to like a whole album during that time then I just hear a song here or there. So, okay. Um, all right. Next up is Smashing Pumpkins. Hmm. People love the Smashing Pumpkins. Uh, they have this, this song, uh, 1979. Um, I like a few of their songs, but uh, to rank them above some, some of these others. I'm going to put mean, them. Uh, I'm going to put them low, in B. Yeah, they're, they're low B for me. Actually, I'm gonna move Dylan up to A. Wow, Bob Dylan yeah. climbing. <laughs> but I don't oh think I don't think he's going up from here. I don't think he's going up from here. Um, <laughs> Bob Dylan started in the basement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, okay. Uh, sorry, guys. I, it's just me, guys. Also, it's us. Like you have to understand. It's like it. You know, just if you've listened to a band your whole life, and that doesn't mean we have to like it. So yeah, just for us. Okay. Um, so R H. Okay, of course R H C P. It's it's SS. I actually, for me, I like them more yeah, than a lot of people subscribe. in SS. Congrats um, I it's, I love I love finals. the Red Hot Chili Peppers, so I'm putting them in in SS. I I mean they are great. I think I'm gonna put them in S though. I can't I can't honestly. The reason I don't think I can put them in SS if I look at the tier is if I put them in SS, I can't honestly say that I think they're better than Pink Floyd. I can't. I just can't say. That. I think Pink Floyd is better than them. I think I would I would I I prefer them over Pink Floyd. Pink Floyd is a band that I would I if someone says they're better than RHCP, I'm fine with that. But I I, I like I like the Chili Peppers better than I like Pink Floyd. So that's just my opinion. I'm moving Pink, I, I'm moving Pink Floyd to SS then. I, so it just just because of what you said. I'm moving Pink Floyd to SS. Um, no, Pink I, Pink Floyd's my number one. Oh, oh, I didn't realize that. Okay, okay. No, no, like, like I have Pink Floyd, Elvis, The Beatles, Jimi Hendrix, Rolling mm -hmm. Stones, and I put Red Hot Chili Peppers in SS. But, um, like, I understand the effect Pink Floyd had, mm -hmm. but I like more of Red Hot Chili Peppers music. So, that's okay. All. Okay, I mean, I think they're S for me, but they're they're probably bot probably bottom tier S. Also, you know what I'm gonna say? Mm -hmm. Every Pink Floyd man, uh, Pink Floyd fan I met in my life was a douchebag. That's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> so. It's like, you know, it's like, I don't know what it is, but they all wore the dumb t-shirts and all would mm -hmm. tell you about Pink Floyd. I don't know. That's just how, that's just, you know, I've never met a Pink Floyd fan who was like, I really like Pink Floyd. You know, you should listen to them. It was always like, you know, so. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Anyway. So next up we have the Moody Blues. Who are they even? I don't even know who they are. I don't know. I, I want to put them on. I don't even want to go look them up on Spotify. The Moody Blues. Okay, I'll put them in. Don't deserve to be on this list. I don't even know who they are. The Moody Blues. Where are the Bee Gees, by the way? Um, they're not rock, or are they? I don't. How are they not on this list? The Bee Gees. I, what are they exactly? I'm not sure. Guys, you're you're naming a song that. It's the only song the Moody Blues ever really made. They're disco. Oh, disco, disco, disco. I just want the Bee Gees on this list. I'd put them in SS and that'd be that. 
Um, oh, they're oh they're considered more like ah uh, yeah they're considered more like disco dance yeah disco actually sounds right yeah that's true yeah good point okay next up is golden faring fearing e- earring oh, I also earring? was confused okay. yeah apparently okay. golden earring I I don't know who golden earring is I I don't know straight up have no idea just like the moody blues <laughs> I'm putting them in don't belong because I don't know who they are. Okay, so what do we have next? We have um, Queen. Okay, so Queen. What One of the thoughts? only bands on this list that have a movie made about them, basically, right? I mean, well, I mean, I, I guess, yeah, yeah. I don't, I don't, I don't know about uh, Golden Earring. Uh, yeah, Queen is. Um, I, I, I don't. If you say SS, I put an SS. For me, it's like S. I but, mean, I, uh, I just it's too iconic for me. It's SS. I mean, okay, it's one hundred percent SS. Not even a question for me. If you defer, then I put Queen up there. Yeah, it, it's it's SS one hundred percent. Um, more iconic than Pink Floyd. Um, whew. I mean, you have a different ranking system because you're you you you're, you're for whatever reason you have a problem with the Beatles. Um, no, I put them in SS. <laughs> I, I mean, I. I think I think I put them number two. Okay. Yeah, I have to shuffle around my SS actually. I I, I don't Elvis so far is my number two, but I haven't moved it around. So yeah, um, yeah, I think they're number two. Okay, next up is is um is David. What are your thoughts? Ooh, massive, 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 massive. Uh, S tier. S tier. Uh, yeah, I agree too. Hundred percent. Yeah, S tier, not like very very top of s i don't know right next to chuck i have chuck berry as the top of s i don't have him as ss oh really okay yeah so yeah um, I, I think s i think s near near the top of s though probably I mean, middle to top ish yeah i think s yeah queen over david bowie of course queen over david bowie what of course <laughs> how is that even is that even a conversation okay i didn't realize um yeah, next up is the Who, right? No, it's wait, the Guess oh, Who. Wait, what? Wait, what? What is the Guess Who? Wait, it's what? a real thing. American woman. <laughs> okay. You know what? Just for impersonating the Who, they get D. I, I actually kind of agree. I think that's pretty pathetic too. Why is the Who not on here? Yeah. Straight to D. I mean, I don't even. I, I yeah. agree. I, I agree. Yeah, it's like I agree. I mean, yeah, that's such a ripoff. Like such a rip. I, I think people apparently they came first, but it doesn't even matter. <laughs> like, I don't even care. Yeah. Is the Who here? Oh, they are. Oh. They are. They are. Oh, they oh, are. Okay. They actually are. I didn't. I didn't okay. realize they're on the list. Awesome. They are. Okay. Pug. So next up we have what's this group? Three. I can't tell. What what is this? Uh, I don't know. Yeah. What what is this? Oh, is it, it's it's Aerosmith. Oh man, what are your thoughts on Aerosmith? Oh man, I I love Aerosmith. Um, really? Okay. Yeah. Damn. Not not I <laughs> I I really enjoy Aerosmith music. <laughs> um, but people say overrated. I'm not I'm not crazy about them actually. I really enjoy. I, my A is pretty lacking. I, I only have a few in A, so I'll put it, I'll put them in A and mm, I agree. bottom I'll put A. Them in A too. Yeah, bottom, Bo- bottom A. Bottom A. Yeah. Next up is Hearts. What is Hearts? Yeah. What? Wait, I gotta look this up. Heart. Heart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Barracuda. You remember that song? Not right off, no. I played that on a rock band or Guitar Hero. Ooh, ah, okay, okay. Right. Cool. Um, but are they a one-hit wonder? Not right. No, no, no. Okay. Um, I think probably what, like B? I'm going to put them in B. I think I'll... Or C or B. I'll put them top... I'll put them bottom of B. I'm afraid of getting canceled, so I'm gonna put them at the top of SS. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I, 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 I I'm gonna put them in bottom of C. Okay, next of course is CCR. What are your thoughts on CCR? 
Very, very positive. Mm -hmm. uh, very positive. I think that people know the profound uh, historical effect slightly better than me. Um, I, I, I'm, I don't know if I'm quite ready to, to give them S tier status though, because uh, sorry, SS tier status. They're S. Oh, really? Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna put them at the top of A on my list. No, I, 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 th I think they're a bottom S tier. Mm, okay. Okay. Could be. Yeah. Okay, that's pretty much what I said. I just put them in A instead of at the bottom of SS instead of S. But yeah, that sounds about right. I think they're well. I ha I also have Eagles and S. So for me, my S is Chuck Berry, uh, David Bowie, Eric Clapton, CCR. We have a very so, different list. This is interesting. Our lists are quite different. Well, that's, that's good. I mean, it's... Okay, so next up we have the Mamas and the Papas. Okay, this is pretty ancient. Um, they have one song. Uh, and I only know their song, this song, because I heard it in a video game as a kid. And I really liked it. California Dreamin'. Mm -hmm. uh, other than that, I... I I think they're pretty trash. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I think they're. I think I'm putting them in D. I mean D or they don't even belong. I don't know, but I'm gonna put them in D. I think for now. Yeah, I think I think I think D. Yeah, I just don't think they're great. Okay, next up is the Who. So, what do you think about the Who, Levy? Oh, uh, a lot of hits. A mm -hmm. lot of hits. A uh, lot of hits. A ton of them uh probably for me they go also in they're either number one a or somewhere in along the lines of s uh they're not in ss i would not put the who in ss uh i, I put i put them in s i put them in s right next to ccr right next to ccr they're s the who is s i oh disagree Six, i think i think, nine, I think for me they're ss i think they are ss cents. Okay. Nine hundred and bottom of SS damage. for me. Okay. Okay. Uh, but I, I, yeah, S is S is pretty. I'm I'm pretty happy with with putting them there. Okay. So next um, is Buddy Holly. <laughs> okay. This is uh very old, very old. Let, let me try yeah. to recall. Let me just look him up to remember what his exact hits were. I mean, he's so old. This is like isn't this from like the 30s or 40s or something like so ancient um yeah it's so ancient that if you look at buddy holly you just get weezer <laughs> Grounded, so sad, no i mean you have to be like a true uh connoisseur of rock i think um because i i, I actually don't i can't name uh, i can't name a buddy holly song so basically whatever i'm deferred to i will uh i will rock with yeah i mean it's so uh so old um I mean, I think he was good, but I just... Yeah, there's Peggy Sue, but I just don't know what exactly to put on. So I think I'm just going to put him in... I guess I'll put him in C. I think it's reasonable. Um, okay. Next next one is what? Cree... Cree what? Cream. Create? Cream. 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 London. Okay. London. Right? London uh, Calling? Cream and, and no, that's the others. Clash. That's the Clash. Oh shit! It's the other band that starts with C. Oh, yeah. the Clash isn't even on. Actually, here. why? Yeah, I was gonna say now, why isn't the Clash on here? Yeah, <laughs> oh. yeah. I don't even know what Cream is. Uh, Sunshine of your love. Sunshine of your love. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Cream is also Clapton and oh, the Eric Clapton group. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, is it? Oh, that was his band. Okay, okay. Um, Cream is okay, actually. I. I'm not. I'm not ready to to give it all up, <laughs> but uh, they were good. But uh... I mean, I guess I'm gonna put them in. Um, I'm gonna put them high up on B, maybe at the top. Actually, B, B or A, I guess. Maybe, maybe, maybe A. Actually, I'll put them at the bottom of A. Okay. Um, what is next? Oh, Jefferson Airplane. Wow. Another random one. Um, not not random. I mean, I've heard of them, but kind of... I don't know where to place Jefferson Airplane. Like, are they like a B or are they higher? So I feel like either people are going to say they're an SS or they're just like A. They have, the, well, they have of course, what's it? Starship one? The... the um, what's it called? Star, Starship something? I forgot. Um, 
Nothing's like, gonna. Yeah. Right or wrong? Wait, I don't even know. Sure. Right? I'm, I'm not crazy, right? Oh, Dapper just subscribed. I yeah, they have Starship and they I'm have. Um, what was the other, what's the other one that I've listened to? They changed their name to Jefferson Starship. <laughs> no. Yeah, that's no Starship was the name of the song. Um, right? Or am I crazy? I can't even. I, I can't. I can't. I can't. I don't know. <laughs> oh, they did change them. Okay. Um. Yeah. I. I don't know. Like. I. I think they're good. I. I mean, they're good, but I think they're just probably a B for me. Oh, I'm not. I'm not ready to give. I'm not even ready to give them that. Oh, you want? Okay, I'll put them. In I'm just. I. I'm just. That's just me. Um, fix Toto. No, Toto is trash. <laughs> me personally i don't know i don't know where you have toto but i have toto pretty down down in the dumps yeah, yeah bottom of c sorry guys sorry um toto is pretty velvet, terrible do you know anything about velvet underground um i've heard of them but not right off no no yeah no i i i ss velvet underground is goaded yeah, I'm seeing a lot of SS too. Um, what? I mean, I'm familiar with them, but I I don't know their songs offhand. Um, huh? Velvet Underground loaded. Wow. Oh, uh, I'm gonna put them at like an A. I think I I mean I I think I think SS is way too high. I think I, I mean I feel like for me if I haven't re if I'm not really familiar with the band, it's hard for me to put in S or SS. Yeah, so I, I think actually they're pretty high on it. I'm going to put them at the very top of A. Very top of A. Okay. And next up, um, next up we of course have Led Zeppelin. I, we're ending on a very good note. Mm -hmm. uh, can we just put these two into SS and end the list? <laughs> Doors and SS, I think that's a little bit too high. But I think Led Zeppelin, I mean, not even a question. They're obviously SS. I don't think there's any question. Um. Hundred percent SS. I I th I think I think the doors are really I think okay. the doors are okay. bottom tier SS. Yeah, yeah. Ex ex why exactly? They're just epic. They made so many hits. They, yeah. Wait, I, what? I don't know. Did they? I I I thought Jim Jim Morrison died pretty young. Maybe I'm wrong. But... Riders on the storm, break it. Uh, break on through. People are strange when you're a stranger. Of course. Come yeah. on, baby, light my fire. Oh, yeah, they made a lot of. I don't know. I feel like they made a lot of really good. I, I like the Doors a lot. No, I like the Doors too. I just I didn't think they I didn't think they were around for that long. Um, it's all the sounds we like, you know. Someone on this list is probably like T Rex is the greatest band of all time. I mean, I'm gonna put them at the very top of it, top of S, very top of S. Um, so I think I'm pretty happy with my list. Let me. Let me run through my list quickly. Looks pretty good to me. Um, Where would we put Guns N' Roses? Guns N' Roses? Like, yeah, Guns N' Roses missing. I think, like, things like The Clash are missing. Um, Elton John was something someone else mentioned. I don't know if that's considered rock or not, but, like, something like that also is Guns missing. Guns N' Roses would be... Yeah, Guns N' Roses would... is the big one that's missing. Rush is missing, as you pointed oh. out earlier. ACDC, would they be also, an S tier? The S tier? Definitely, or... definitely S tier, yeah. Yeah, there's so many that are missing here, but Nirvana? Yeah. But Nirvana is grunge, but I guess grunge is an offset kind of, right? Because you can't you can't really do a grunge uh... I, I feel like you can't have Ramones but not Nirvana. I don't know. They, they That's also like... true. Mm hmm That's a fair yeah, point. Where's, where's Kanye West? Where's Metallica? Where is Metallica? But Metallica is metal. But you have Black Sabbath. That's true. Actually, that's true. Yeah, no, that's true. Well, luckily we didn't make the playlist, so or make the uh, tier list, so it's not our not our fault. But yeah, that's true. You're right. If you have um, if you have Black Sabbath, then yeah, you do have to have uh, Metallica. That's a good point. No, Metallica's epic. Enter Sandman, Mariano Rivera. Well, Hikaru and I will reminisce over the the Yankees. See, yeah. yeah, at least we don't have team beef. You know, at Springsteen least you're not. Like is another Mets one who's missing too. By the way. Oh yeah. 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 These kids know chess. Music not too much. Thank you, CW55CW, for that. 
Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's all oh ZZ Top is also yeah that's true ZZ Top. Uh, oh yeah, Bon Jovi's missing. Mm-hmm. Bon Jovi's missing. I yeah, I mean I think it's there's just too many too many groups. It's it's just it's very hard. I, I feel like if you want to do a proper tier 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 maker, you'd have to have like a hundred groups listed. You can't have like fifty. You'd have to have right. uh, yeah. Leonard Leonard Skinner also is missing. Um, you too. You yeah also yeah good point yeah. Uh, yeah, that's a lot. Well, you can't have modern bands like uh, Muse or something, but uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, I I love Muse by the way. Don't get me wrong, but yeah, they don't um they don't belong. This is just a, it's different. One Direction. Oh, oh, no, no. But, like, Oasis is another one that's missing, by the way. Thank you to CW55 for the 10 gifted subs. Uh, you, might, you might not like our music choices, but thank you for liking the stream. Um. <laughs> this is true. Yeah. Is true. Um, Scorpions, Scorpions, to me, missing is hard. Yeah, like, I think the biggest ones that are missing, you're right. Guns N' Roses has to be on this list. Metallica has to be on this list. Um, Rush, I, I think, has to be on this list. Yeah, um, yeah. Those are the three that 100% are missing. And then, yeah, you get into the ones like Bon Jovi or, I mean, Springsteen. Um, oh, I mean, Dire Straits. Oh, yes. Actually, I was going to play their song on the intro, and I forgot. But, yeah, they're they're missing. Um, yeah, yeah, th- yeah, that's true. They're, they're probably like – I think if we thought really hard, we'd come with like 15 that would have to be on this list. Nirvana, Nirvana, I think, also has to be on this list as well. 100% Nirvana has to be on this list. Um, ACDC has to be honest. Yeah, there are probably like 10 right off that we could come up with, I think. Oh, there's also Pearl Jam. Pearl Jam I forgot about as well. Yeah, Pearl Jam. Yeah. REM maybe. Yeah, there's just so many. It just it goes on forever. There's so many. All right, so for the with. next one, we have to rank rappers. Uh, we have to do our research on rappers. I, I mean, is Logic on the list or not? Well, would... I get sure. Yeah, probably. Okay, okay, we better be careful then, because if, if if I do it wrong, he's gonna send me a text and he's gonna be like, "Dude, what WTF? What's your problem?" Like, that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. Um, 